Ghana is now exporting its nurses to work in other countries. This is the reason behind. Can you believe that Ghana is now exporting nurses to other countries? Nurse migration, particularly from low- and middle-income countries to high-income countries, has emerged as a global concern. Another group of Ghanaian nurses will work in Barbados healthcare system for the next two years. The nurses who arrived at Grantley Adams International Airport, GAIA, on Monday, October 10, are expected to help alleviate the island's current nurse shortage. Expecting 56 nurses from Ghana to join the Queen Elizabeth Hospital and 66 to join the agencies of the Ministry of Health. That is the geriatric hospital, psychiatric hospital, and polyclinic system. These are nurses of all areas of specialization. Ghana is the first country to make it a policy to send nurses abroad. It appears that Ghana is becoming the Cuba of Africa, with its government earning approximately $8 billion in revenue per year from its nurses and professional services provided by its doctors and nurses in over 70 countries worldwide. In this video, we will explain why the Ghanaian government is now exporting nurses to other countries and the benefits to Ghana. Please like, share, and subscribe to Africa Reloaded. Also, please share your thoughts in the comments section. Nursing is a healthcare profession that focuses on the care of individuals, families, and communities in order for them to achieve, maintain, or recover optimal health and quality of life. A nurse's responsibilities range from emergency care decisions to vaccine administration in schools, homes, and communities. Registered nurses can work in a variety of settings, but becoming one requires extensive training. South Africa, Kenya, Nigeria, Ghana, and other African countries have some of the best nurses on the continent. However, we are focusing on Ghanaian nurses in this video. Ghana has 79 training healthcare institutions spread across the country, and this institution provides education to Ghanaians who want to practice nursing. The Ghana Education Service is in charge of overseeing and operating these nursing training colleges. The nurses produced by these colleges in the country meet international standards by adhering to the protocols of the International Council of Nurses ICN and the International Confederation of Midwives ICM. According to Ghana's Director of Human Resources for Health, Dr. Kwezi Asabre, the country produces over 20,000 nurses each year. The figure appears impressive, but a significant number of students who complete nursing training in the country end up unemployed because the country produces more nurses than they require. As of January 2019, the country had approximately 40,000 unemployed nurses and midwives. As a result, nurses, doctors, midwives, and other professionals trained in the country have privately made their way to work in countries such as the United Kingdom, the United States, Canada, the Middle East, and others with the government getting nothing from them. As a result, the Ghanaian government has decided to follow in Cuba's footsteps by exporting excess health expertise to other countries in order to support countries in need of nurses and provide opportunities for unemployed nurses. Barbados is the first country to have received nurses from Ghana. Despite producing nurses, Barbados, like many other hospitals around the world, faces nursing shortages. It is for this reason that they have signed a deal with Ghana to receive the excess, excellent, and quality nurses produced in Ghana for the global market to meet up their health needs. Juliet Bino Sutherland, Executive Chairman of the Queen Elizabeth Hospital, explained to the media at the GAIA that these qualified nurses will be assigned to the Queen Elizabeth Hospital and various Ministry of Health agencies. We anticipate 66 nurses from Ghana joining the Queen Elizabeth Hospital and 56 joining the Ministry of Health's agencies, which include the Geriatric Hospital, Psychiatric Hospital, and Polyclinic System. These are nurses from various specialties who were specifically recruited to join us here in Barbados. They are all experts in their fields. Like many hospitals around the world, we are experiencing nursing shortages, and there are some countries, such as Ghana, that are producing excellent nurses for the global market. 
The export of nurses, midwives, and other health professionals from Ghana to other countries will help these nurses find work and earn enough money to support their families. According to the Ghanaian government, this policy will not only generate revenue for the country, but will also protect and secure all Ghanaian nurses and healthcare providers from exploitation in foreign countries. This will be a huge benefit for her, because she is expected to profit more than $5 billion per year from this deal. Thank you for watching all the way through. Please help us by liking and subscribing to Africa Reloaded. Do not forget to share your thoughts with us in through the comment section and click the notification icon to receive alerts of our new videos.